Your Excellency, General Zakaria, Sheikh Ibrahim, the Chief of the General Staff of Djibouti Defense Force, distinguished members of delegation, all protocol observed, ladies and gentlemen, good morning. On behalf of, on behalf of Field Marshal Brahan Jula, Chief of General Staff of Ethiopian National Defense Force, and that of my own, it is a great pleasure and privilege for me to take this opportunity to thank you for the warm and brotherly welcome and hospitality accorded to me and my delegation since our arrival in this historic city of Djibouti, which is, of course, our second home. And thank you for hosting me and my delegation. In this critical time, which requires mutual cooperation between our sisterly countries to overcome common security challenges and strengthen the existing excellent and long-standing historic relationship the two countries are enjoying for I would like to appreciate the Djibouti Armed Force for being by our side whenever, whenever the Defense Force of Ethiopia need your assistance at critical time. My appreciation go to the member of your Defense Force, especially the adjustment unit for this rest restless efforts to make the border. The border areas are secured Ethiopia Defense Force in particular and the Ethiopian government in general will never forget what the Djibouti Defense Force has been providing assistance at any critical times. Allow me, General, to say a few words on the well-established relation between Djibouti and Ethiopia. The relation between Ethiopia and Djibouti dates back to century. Despite change of relationship in both Ethiopia and Djibouti, their relations have remained strong based on mutual trust and cooperation. Their relation is established established on a strong foundation and cordial, cordial cooperation focused on matters of mutual interest. I believe that, faced with the continued suffering in Ethiopia, Djibouti simply cannot stand by any vice versa, which more work, a peaceful future. It is possible in our countries. It is mandatory. Therefore, further strengthening of the already existing excellent relation between the two countries should be maintained and expanded.